you know, sperm is cheap, eggs are expensive. I mean, a lot of Miami girls can do it without caring. Yeah, I, but there's still a filter, a though. There's still a filter. Like, you, like women still need, they, they still need some things uh, satisfied before they're going to have sex with a dude. Mm -hmm. Like, even the girl that, even the most promiscuous of women are going to be far more conservative in their mate selection than the, even the most conservative of a man. Does that make sense? Because, mm -hmm. like, w women have a bunch of filters. We asked you guys earlier, what do you want in a guy? $100,000 a year, at least six feet tall. I'm sure they have to have some type of uh, game and verbal skill to some degree. Yeah. Men don't have these requirements, guys. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's, it's far more difficult for men to get sexual access. So the point I'm trying to make is this. Since you've been 18 years old and you've been attractive, you've had attention from the opposite gender. Without mm -hmm. trying, mm -hmm. men don't get that luxury. So if a man becomes a multimillionaire, successful, uh, a musician, world renowned, he should absolutely have the ability to have a sex with as many women as he wants, and his girl should be able to accept that and understand that. Accept <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> what? It, because no. here's the thing. Yeah. Well, it comes down to supply and demand. Who's the rare commodity? Okay, so let's say. Hold on. Here. No, no, no. Answer the question. Who's the rare commodity? Him or her? Her? Absolutely not. It's him. He's the rapper. He's the one that's a celebrity. A He's the one that too. makes the money. She makes money too. Irrelevant though. Because here's the thing. Men don't care about how much money a woman makes. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Mm -hmm. Men have zero care about clout, financial income, stability, any of that. Women do though. So who is the actual prize here? I have to disagree because there are a lot of guys now in this Who's generation. the prize? Yes or him or her? Her. And I'm going to explain to sure. you why. Tell me why. Um, a lot of guys now, like, they see that, like, women, they require men to have money. So, like, once, like, women require that from men, mm -hmm. they're like, okay, well, what is she bringing to the table? Like, what is she doing? What can she do for me? Like, some guys don't just want to have, like, a charity case. Some guys want to have someone that already has something going for them, someone that's independent. And she's very, very independent. It just comes down to, I feel like, status and all of that money. And when you're a rapper, you get so much attention from, like, women all over the world. You know what I mean? So it's a lot of temptation. But at the end of the day, what should really, like, ground you is the love that you have for your person. You know, like, they've been together for so long. Like, cheating should not be in the equation at all. But it is for a lot of relationships. And it's a sad thing. <laughs> I I, I, oh I, I see what you're saying, but like that's not the real world. Like that like that sounds nice. It sounds mm -hmm. idealistic. It sounds like a Disney fairy tale. But men, to be honest with you, be very candid, do not care about a woman's financial stability, her security, her clout. None of that because men are taught from a young age. You must become. You're the one that's got to perform. Yes, men you, are supposed to provide. Exactly. Completely. So men. So so yeah. these things that you're mentioning. Oh, she has her own money. She's independent. Men mm -hmm. don't give a fuck about that. They really don't. And I, and I don't mean. I don't say that to be disrespectful. But mm -hmm. the things that you're attributing to attraction are are what women want, not necessarily what men want. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you what men don't like though, and what? this is this goes to show the gross, uh, you know, lack of knowledge of Western women is. Going on a t radio show and saying that you're going to have a threesome with three men is unacceptable, completely unacceptable, because uh, men don't want to ever feel, especially high status men, they mm -hmm. don't want to ever have to feel that their girl is a hoe and getting made fun of. You want to know how you hurt a guy? You hurt a guy by doing some hoe shit and then him finding out after the fact and getting laughed at. That's how you destroy a man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So she violated. And the fact that you don't understand that, I don't blame you. You're 24 years old. You're young. But you should know. I understand, though. Yeah, but you're, like, trying to, like, but rationalize it's her. Not even that. I see things from both sides. You know what I mean? And, like, it's not my relationship. So, honestly, it's, like, I don't really care that much. But, like, I can see it from both sides. Like, I can see why he would probably feel some type of way. But it's, like, on the other end, it's, like, why is it okay if a guy wants a threesome? It could be with two girls, but if a girl wants a threesome with two guys, it's a train. Okay, it, it's it, a because be, it, no, it's not because men and women are not the same. You get sexual access simply by existing. You don't have to work for your sexual access. Men do. Yo, That's why it's unacceptable. Anytime you add more like, than one guy, it's a train. Yeah, <laughs> like 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 here's it. Like I'm telling you, like it's not the same. Like it's easy for a girl to get sex. It is not easy for a man to have sex. That's why I'm telling you, if dudes want to run around and they want like high status men, high value men. Girls understand when they date rappers, athletes, celebs, whatever it is, mm -hmm. they're okay with sharing them because they understand that comes with the territory. Other women are going to are gonna want him. And that actually makes him more attractive. But a girl that's been ran through, 
No guy wants to take him take her serious. That's why he immediately broke up with her, repoed the car, was like, I'm not going to get laughed at by everybody else because that's how you hurt a man is by embarrassing him and by being a hoe in public. But did it's, he not embarrass her when he cheated? No, because high status men, that's what that's what they do. And they high status men have the leverage. A guy cheating on you is is not even it, that's not a big deal. It's really it really isn't. Like, why do you think Kobe's wife took him back? And so many athletes like take their their woman back. 